All right, guys, check this out. All right, so that's the background music that's playing while I actually talk. I just want to make sure it's not distracting. And you just heard some sound effects. What is going on? What is going on, guys? My name is Sam. We are live right now. And of course, some of the applause, right? People applauding and everything. So those are things that you can actually do using a stream deck. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add those sound effects, background music and things like that using your stream deck while either you live streaming or doing something else in OBS, of course. So let's not take much time. Let's get right into it. So right now I've got OBS open and I've got my stream deck and I've got my stream deck application open as well. Again, if you have never uh, used the stream deck before, I've got another video for showing you how to set it up, how to get the OBS plugins and everything. I'm going to link it down below and at the end of this video. But for now, we're going to focus on uh, adding actually some sound effects. Now, uh, usually when you're streaming, you probably need some sound effects, you know, things like this. This is very popular and people maybe, uh, you know, some sort of applause, people applauding and everything. And you can add whatever you want, including uh, adding some background music that can play in the background. So, and you can trigger that using a stream deck whenever you want, okay? So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to go ahead. What you need to do once you open the Stream Deck application, you go ahead and type in audio. OK, and then what we need is this one called the play audio. OK, this is what we need under soundboard. You can even type in sound board. All right. So once you have this, you we're going to go ahead and grab this one that says play audio. All right. This is the one that we need. OK, so play audio and we're just going to put it anywhere we want. You can assign it to any button that you want. I already had this one. I'm just going to go ahead and delete it. So I'm going to press here. And as you can see, it says get more sound effects from Elgato Marketplace. Or if you hover this here, it's going to give you get more music from Elgato Marketplace. Now, this is where you can get some music if you want, if you don't have your own music. So basically, if you click to it, as you can see, there's some music that you can use for free, right? Some sound effects like this one is super powerful. So if you need some of these, right? Right. If you're doing some sort of like reaction videos and stuff like that, these are going to be awesome, right? Got some whoosh. Right. Again, I will let you play with this. Uh, but usually what we're looking for, the first one that's super popular is this one called Air air horn uh let me see if they have it no they don't have it right so it, it's it's weird because this sound effect is hard to to find but i found a place actually that had it here on pixabay uh it's 100 free i just typed in google you can search in google free air horn effect just gonna show up and i found this one it kind of sounded good it's free free sound <laughs> So it sounded good. All right, just go to pixabay.com or just type in Google free air horn DJ sound, something like that. So I went ahead and just click download and downloaded it and I have it. Now, also you can find any other sound effects, any other music. Now, personally, I use Epidemic Sound and um, that's where I get all my sound effects and, you know, anything that I need. So as, as you can see, unfortunately, sound, uh, Epidemic Sound didn't have that sound effect, which I don't know why. They don't have it anyways i can get any music so i have uh, they have the huge music library and uh some sound effects so i was able to download a few sound effects and everything uh and they're already in my local computer all right so if you can find anything from the elgato marketplace i'm sure you're gonna find some free music there for sure so if i go to music you can see like if you can find some right you can choose by mode and everything and sad epic whatever love you know and then you can filter 
those and then you can use some of these for uh, you know something like if you need some background music and everything for your streams right so let's go ahead and set up our first one which is gonna be the air horn so once we have dragged in here uh what i can call it dj dj horn right and then uh we go to file where it says file so we click to that and then usually we take you to some of the elgato music they have downloaded before or sound effects they have downloaded before but right now i don't have any any that i want to use okay but if you had some that you have downloaded they'll show up there i'm gonna go to downloads and i'm gonna bring in my own music right this is uh, some no this is not music sorry my own sound effects all right so this one right here the dj air horn you can listen to it sounds good click open and the volume if you want to add a little bit of uh, a little more volume you can do that and the output usually you want to output your default speakers or whatever speaker they have set up just leave it the way it is and that's pretty much it all right so now if i click on this button here that we just added this is this says dj horn you can hear we got the sound effect right now you can also hit the plus sign and add you know some sort of like icon so they say sound so there's nothing for sound they say speaker you know again you can just uh, browse and find something that sound that looks good that goes with what you have there so usually i will use something like this and boom right so now we have it set up now anytime <laughs> just hit it and then boom i can also uh, go ahead and add another one so play sound uh, play audio and this one i can call it uh just go to download and this is the upload applause right people cheering and everything all right i got this from epidemic sound link in the description if you're interested it's not free it's a paid service but i love it right so that's something that you can use they say you know maybe you have a guest on and you want to you know do something some clapping and everything again you can choose any sound effect that you want really this is just to give you an example again we can name it whatever you want you can say applause and you can change the volume a little down or up and then play action usually you want to play and stop or play overlap play blah 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 loop if you want it to loop if it's like some background music you probably want it to loop right so that's pretty much it now you can you can change the icon like what i just showed you the last one i'm gonna show you how to add background music so let's say you're talking and then you want some background music to be playing in the background right yeah just lower the volume and then whenever you want to have some background music that would be nice right so just gonna go here and then do the same process uh go ahead and look for the file now again it's gonna take you all the time into the elgato audio uh folder if you have some background music there you can just use that one if you have some downloaded you can use that one so right now i'm gonna use the one that i have in there from the stream deck audio that i downloaded from their marketplace right and it's called future now but you can change it to background music right and then again you can add an icon you already know how to do that and then action you can loop it right loop stop right so when you hit the button it's gonna play it's gonna keep looping and whenever you want it stop you just hit it again it's gonna stop and that's pretty much it the volume you want to make it a little uh you know take it down a little bit because you want to speak over it so if i hit it now right we can take it to like three percent because you don't want it to you know to be a distraction when you're talking uh over it right you want people to be able to hear you right you can even, even do like two percent what is going on guys welcome to the stream this is my background music blah 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 blah, blah. that's it right and if, whenever if you feel like you need to stop it you can go ahead and actually hit the same button on the stream deck boom 
start it stop it that's pretty much it guys that's how you add your background music and sound effects to your stream deck and of course since everything's gonna be running in obs right everything's gonna be coming through the system's audio so if i hit the background music right now you guys can see it because in obs i only have only have my microphone added okay now the key right now because i'm using the roadcaster duo as my main interface and i have my mic coming in and that's the roadcaster duo so whatever i choose to hit right now right it's gonna come in right so even if i stay quiet you can still see the signal right so that's coming from my roadcaster duo because that sound is playing it's being played back through my roadcaster duo so that's a little different if you didn't have an interface like the roadcaster duo right you had normal speakers and microphone that's connected directly to your computer what you would do is you can go ahead and hit the plus sign and then go to what it says audio output capture not the input output capture and then what you need to do is you want to capture the system's audio okay they say system okay and then you want to go here and then you capture whatever main speaker that's connected right here so if i go here you say my main speaker is the speaker roadcaster duo in your case it would be something else okay whatever is your main speaker that's the one you want to capture because that's where the audio is going through right bring it in like this now once i bring it in right now it's not good because i already have it going through my roadcaster but that's how you would do it and whenever you play something as you can see right now it's playing so when i hit the um the sound effect uh, as you can see like it's showing my background music is coming in right but again this will not be a good idea to do if you're running something like the roadcaster duo because it's still coming in anyways so if you do this way it's gonna come in twice and it's gonna cause some echo so this is gonna depend on the type of interface that you are using but most of you guys you may end up using the system audio option uh again if you're not using something like the roadcaster pro the roadcaster duo kind of thing right so this is one thing compared to all the good stuff you can do with the stream deck now i have another video that i made guys showing you how to set up the stream deck from start to finish how to control all the scenes in obs and guys this is like a beginner's kind of guide that's gonna show you everything that you know about controlling obs and the stream deck that video is gonna be linked right here so make sure to check it out guys and i'll see you there take care